and it is breakout players that we are expecting in 2021. Guys who, you know, maybe we thought they were going to come on a little bit sooner and just haven't quite gotten there to this point, or maybe in some cases a rookie who's going to show up. Everybody wants to talk about the offense, and guess what? I do, too, and I'm going to start with Joe Burrow. He's going to be my breakout player, you guys. The quarterback, the first-round pick, the uh, former overall first pick of the Cincinnati Bengals. Remember that ACL-MCL devastating injury back in week 11 of last season? Well, he told us kind of an 85% uh, feel, you know, heading into mandatory camp. I think Joe Burrow is going to build on those 269 pass yards per game and there's a couple reasons he's going to be able to do it his offensive line has to protect he, they gave up 48 sacks a season ago 32 of those joe burrow took and they've got to get back to running the football with joe mixon i think he's going to be healthy we saw him in just six games last season this team has struggled to find a consistent run game what does zach taylor the head coach do you guys he brings in former coach with this staff, offensive line coach Frank Pollock. He's also going to be the run game coordinator. He and Joe Mixon have a fantastic relationship. That's been publicly made very clear. And I think we're going to see Mixon improve upon those mm, two, three and a half yards per game on the ground last season. The injury obviously didn't help. And Joe Burrow, he's got to be protected. Riley Reef has joined this offensive line. Uh, they drafted Jackson Carmen in the second round. And then you're going to see Higgins, you're going to see Chase, and yes, Boyd work in the middle. And boy, we are in for something, Mark, with Jamar Chase reunited with his quarterback from LSU, where we, I, I guess you could say, saw fireworks that last season together. No question, Stacy. Last time they were on the field, Jamar Chase and Burrow. Jamar had 224 yards, two touchdowns, nine catches, and it was destroying everybody in the national championship game. So I love the Joe Burrow breakout, and Chase, I think, will break out as well to be the offensive rookie of the year. He was the most talented wide receiver that I scouted since Julio Jones and A.J. Green came out in 2011. A lot of other great wide receivers, but he was right there at the top as far as the best guy I scouted. Uh, and I think you always talk about practice reps with quarterbacks and receivers being on the same page. Well, these guys don't even have to practice together because they did it at the highest level. We know Joe Burrow won just about every award when he was a coming out of LSU that year. So that synergy that these two have, I think, will put them on the field right away to break out together.